uh, walking home and in the middle of the road is literally him. Oh my God. So as I'm walking towards him, actually, he's ran towards me to sort of meet me halfway. He was very thin, for one, very thin. He was completely frozen. He was like shaking and stuff like that. Okay. So I ended up picking him up and then taking him home. He was very hungry, very dirty as well. He just sort of got a cloth and sort of wiped his hands down because they were completely muddy from him being outside for obviously so long. And we had to actually trim off like bits of his hair because that like, mud got stuck on it. He wasn't in the best of shape. It wasn't like he was hurt or injured or anything too serious, but he wasn't in the best of shape. My initial response was, you know what, let's find where he did come from. We're sort of trying to debate even to this day to be like, how long was he outside for? Where did he come from? I don't even think rabbits could last more than a day by themselves, domesticated ones anyway. I, I think someone just did release him. I think they were just hard to take care of or whatever it was. They had a lit off so many. So they just ended up just releasing him, I think. It wasn't in my agenda to find a rabbit and take care of a rabbit. But I decided, you know, let me just keep him. Our relationship is, is special. But I, did, I didn't know that until people started obviously telling me that. So when people are telling me like, yo, rabbits aren't normally like this. Rabbits, you know, normally run away or they're very shy or they're this and that. The fact that he's acting like this around you, you have a very special bond. I thought this is what rabbits are normally like. Bro's really chilling on my back. On my back. So it's only after I just started posting what life is like with him, people are like, this is amazing, this is special. I thought this was normal. I thought this is what all sort of bunny owners are going through. You know what's going on? That like, do you know that you're a rabbit, I'm a human, this is a room, you're in a house, it's Monday, like, do you know what's going on? Or do you, like, just live? Good talk, good talk. Mm. Just through him, my life has changed a lot. Mm. I'm in a whole nother space now where I need to consider him a lot more, if that makes sense. So it's not just, you know, about me, whereas before I had no responsibilities. You know what I mean? It's just me, myself. But now it's like, I need to consider, okay, has he eaten? Has he had his monthly vet checkup? Has he done A, B, C, and D? You know, it's sort of like I've been put in this responsibility role that I wasn't, you know, sort of used to in that sense. I've had to learn a lot for one as well. I've been spending hours on YouTube, Googling why do bunnies do this? Or what does it mean when your bunny does that? Personality wise, he's very friendly. Very, very friendly. See, right now he's just causing so much havoc. So I'd say, Mischievous. He's completely destroyed all my bed sheets, majority of my walls, like my wallpaper. He's torn that down. Definitely, definitely very mischievous. Oh my. Cheeky and charismatic. He's very, he's very charismatic, and he gets along with, with literally everyone. Yeah, everyone loves him, and he loves everyone. Oh, this